Good morning everybody, this is James Bender with Waypoint Survival and today I want to show you a hack for your ferro rod. Uh, of course we use ferro rods a lot in survival in our training school here, Waypoint Survival. But uh, everybody's pretty familiar by this time with this uh, ferro rod. This is half inch by six. Fairly standard now for a lot of guys and gals in bushcrafting. And it's got a hole drilled in the end, so you can use it for, you know, putting in a cord or some kind of a, of a thong. Attach it to your, your belt, your knife sheath, whatever, so you don't lose it. And it's good by itself. It works pretty well. But I was thinking some time ago of how I could improve this. And I know some guys wrap duct tape around it, and that's good for a handle. For extra duct tape is always a great thing to have. But uh, I saw something in the home improvement store and started put two and two together and I thought that would be a great hack and I wanted to show it to you guys. So what it is, is a crayon holder. It's made by Dixon and it's got this nut on it and a half inch by six ferro rod fits right in it because the crayons are half inch diameter. It's got a hole in the end it's where the piece of paracord is with the striker. This is not my preferred striker, it just happens to be the one that I have attached to this ferro rod for the present. So uh, anyway, what I want to show you is uh, this right here. Let me adjust a little bit down. So basically this nut here, and you would uh, just unscrew it like so, and you slide this out, whatever length. You can see I've, I've been striking on it somewhat here. So you can put it in for storage. Attach your loop, striker, tighten it down, and it holds it fairly securely. And of course, when you get ready, you want to do some striking. So, yeah, it works pretty good. Just a little hack. Uh, I've not seen anybody else do. Maybe somebody else has, but uh, maybe this will help somebody and give you... Uh, some inspiration, different things you can do, and I will be posting some other videos about different hacks that I use in teaching my survival class and different things that I have discovered that will help you uh, to survive. So, out here in southern Ohio, and as you can see behind me, uh, it's my uh, little temporary shelter that I've built, and we can be doing some other videos on this in the future. So... This is James Bender from Waypoint Survival. You can check us out at Facebook, Waypoint Survival, and then also our website, waypointsurvival.com. This is where we post all our information about our classes, and of course we link it to Facebook as well. But this is James Bender. I appreciate your support. Thank you all so much for your time, for watching, and I hope that uh, this will help some of you guys. And look forward to talking to you next time.